hello friends welcome to science and technology today in this video i will show how to run qbasic in any android mobile so to run qbasic follow the steps what i am doing first we go to google to download the qbasic exe file the link which i am using is available in the description of the video so please refer to that it's coming so it will open in google drive from google drive you have to download it like what I have done then we have to open the play store and search for free box and you have to install this application I have already installed this is a DOS application so now we have to open the file explorer here as we have downloaded the file it will be in the download folder so from download folder we have to move it it should be in the internal storage of the phone and we have to make a folder the folder name should be qbasic under the qbasic folder we have to paste the qb.exe file First, we have to open the Freebox application which we have downloaded from the Play Store. It's opening. We have to turn on the keyboard by clicking to the keyboard logo which is located after the Freebox. Type whatever I am typing. Mount D. Here I have written D because the internal memory of a mobile Android mobile works as a D drive. Now we have to set the location. It is SD card. Here it is written that drive D is mounted as the local directory. So we are successful till now. Then the final step. After that when we when I will enter Q basic will happen. We will be amazed. See. Here we have to move the cursor by dragging our finger in the screen because in Android mouse is not there I will show you a sample program that it is running or else you will not believe it this is a program which will simply print hello world then we have to run it go to run start see it has worked it will run any type of QBasic program so that's all for today please subscribe to my channel